Okay. Yeah, we're trying out Yunto. Hopefully it's not a fast game, but yeah. 50, 80, 20% attack speed. And it's like, it's kind of like a man immune. I, I think at least like every single time you auto someone, you get permanent crit chance. Crit and man immune. And then every auto or the first auto, you get 30% attack speed. So that was pretty fucking OP on Yone. Then you get the item, you instantly go in, you get 50% attack speed. And the whole trade, you get like permanent crit chance. But yeah, I'm playing on 200 ping, so it might be kind of difficult. Build pop isn't amazing. Yeah, the fact that there's like a slingshot I think this item stinks. Yeah, actually, you know what? The build pop fucking stinks. No, scout slingshot. I wish it was like zeal. If it was a zeal, it feel good. But it, it can't be zeal because um, it doesn't actually have crit chance. <laughs> but yeah, do not expect a mechanical gameplay with this ping. I have not played on ping this high in uh, I don't think ever. Like literally never. Oh god. It's okay. He's probably lagging just as hard. Maybe. Can you believe there's people that have this high of ping and they play every day? I couldn't even auto. <laughs> oh, hell no. Nah. Also, why do I have lethal tempo? Well, like, poop tempo. This shit's ass. Okay. It's a high ping. But yeah, this is why I don't like tempo. It has literally done nothing the whole outlink. Well, we could still do. Uh... Oh, wait. We can do four. Like, technically, if you have a back where you can get four daggers, you can do it. Because, like, two of them go into Berserkers and two of them go into Yuntal. I, I think three daggers is better than going to... And again, we can play about lethal, but picking it anyway, dude. I forgot to take it off. My fault. Oh my god. Nah, it's actually not possible. How do you play with this ping? It's like reacting to- I pressed E to dodge his like second E. It didn't go off for like an hour. They didn't give her a walk animation. They just got, uh... Okay, not the worst. But I can kill this guy too. Okay, high ping doesn't matter. Well, I wouldn't actually buy the episode there, I think. Hmm. Okay, what I noticed though is like, yeah, the build path for this is really awkward. Like if you don't get a back where you can get the BF sword, it's, it was fucking awful. Yeah, that's a bit weird. Definitely a bit awkward. But yeah, I'm just gonna rush the item. I'm gonna Luckily, a lot of people on the server has like the same thing as us, probably. Okay, well, we have the item at seven minutes. So it's very interesting. I've never seen an item like this. It's very weird. So it doesn't give you any crit, but then you're gonna see my crit go up the more I fight. I don't think that's a cooldown either. Wait, 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 on attack? Oh, wait, what the hell? It's not on champions? Oh, wait, why? Is that intended? That's interesting. Oh, wait, this is just OP then. I legitimately almost have the full amount already. Dude, playing this game on 200 ping is not fun. I can't do anything mechanical. Okay though, it's fine. Well, I would imagine you can't really go shield. Could you go shield those second? I guess you could. I'll just do it though. No, that's an easy double kill, but I can't really dodge anything. But yeah, I've been attacking two waves and I already have 31% crit. Yeah, I mean, I guess you could just go shield bow. If you're like Yuntol, shield bow, and then like death dance or something. But I feel like that might be a lack of damage. A little bit. He didn't choose. <laughs> I press the flash button, it takes like 
another two seconds to go out. Oh, hell no. Nah. Yeah, no, this is gonna feel so good. I think, I do think Bork is still gonna be like the move though. On, y on Yone, at least. Like if you're against Mage and you're against like a lot of tanks, you're still gonna go Bork. But now this is like an option if they're like all squishy and like, and you just got 100% crit at two items. Really good and something we've, a lot of people have missed. Bork's still the best. Eh? I mean, if they're all squishy, I don't know why you would go Bork over Yontel. Yontel has to be better. Like, the amount of damage that you're gonna do with uh, Yuntel compared to Bork and Squishies is, like, insane, by the way. This is so much more damage. I'm fucking dead. You probably could go shield, like, shield bow second, though, over IE. I'm not sure what's better. I'm just gonna do IE and then go into, like, Jack Show or something. That's what I'm thinking. Because, like, if you're gonna build Yuntel versus, like, squishy people anywhere where you don't need, like, that much damage, so it's probably Yuntel shield. You could do Yuntel IE if you're, like, really far ahead because, like, it's gonna scale, like, really fucking OP. Yuntel IE and then, like, Jack Show. Obviously, it's like hard to see because I mean, it's PVE and I just have IE Yuntel at 14 minutes. Everyone's just gonna die in legit one auto attack. But yeah, that's how it always was. It's like Bork is a better first item, but if you have a free matchup, you may as well just go Yuntel and then Spike at two items really hard because yeah, that's how it always was. It used to be like you could go Bork some games because you needed to in the past and it just felt really awkward because had no defensive stats at three. So basically, if you're going this, like your three item spike is gonna be insane compared to like the Bork build, which is like one item spike is not feels good. But the three item spike with this is gonna feel like disgusting broken. This Amumu is my biggest op, I swear to god. Nah! I can't kill this guy! Honestly, I'm kinda surprised I didn't do more damage. It's okay. Now I'm immortal. Like, I'm feeling like it's like these three items and then... Probably Bloodthirster. When they do that to the item, they give it attack speed, 50 AD, and it gives you 25% crit after you auto like a certain amount of times. And the passive gives you 30% more crit. Basically, Yasuo and Yone can get 100% crit at two items now. Finally. After half a year of not having it. This is how it used to be in the old days too, before like Bork became the meta build. It was like, cra you went Kraken. I think it was Kraken into IE, right? It was like Kraken IE, and then you'd go Jack Show third. I imagine having Conquer with this build too. Holy. Um. Landing your nail with 200 ping. I'm sorry. I can't do it. Isn't this guy strong? Oh, that guy does not take damage. The fuck? But yeah, ideally you would never go tempo. It's definitely either flee or conquer. Uh, what is what is happening? Oh my god! I'm having a panic attack. I'm playing against that champion. Yeah, like imagine I conquered that whole fight. Or does Fleet for healing? They somehow made a rune that I hate more than Fleet. That's kind of crazy. I assume since Yuntel gives you tempo worth of attacks your cross, you could have... Eh, I don't know. I think it'd be better to have Conquer or Fleet just so you have healing in the build. But yeah, no. This build, new item, probably gonna be core on Yone. 100%. Nah, that shit's OP. That shit's definitely gonna be OP.
Uh.